Hi, I'm Erin. I'm a customer success specialist with Hypothesis. And today we're going to talk about how to OCR a PDF you would like to use with Hypothesis in your learning management system, such as Canvas or Blackboard or Moodle or even D2L. Every PDF you use with Hypothesis needs to have what we call an OCR layer. If you've saved an article or something from the web or even something from Word or Google Drive as a PDF to your device, there already is an OCR layer added. However, if by chance you scan something, let's say a book you like to teach, uh, and into your computer from a copy machine or from a scanner, then it's likely that that text does not have an OCR layer. OCR, or optical character recognition, means that the system is able to read the text in your article as text and not as one big image. This is important because when you're using Hypothesis, you must be able to highlight individual items of text or pieces of text to be able to annotate. Fortunately, here at Hypothesis, we have created a tool to help you OCR the text that you have scanned into your computer. Or, you know, maybe you've got an old text that you had saved from ages ago and it does need an OCR layer. I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen and we'll take a look at what I'm talking about. If you look at the text on your screen, this is a scanned newspaper article. I believe it's from 2016. As you can see, the text is kind of bent and curved. It does not have an OCR layer. Maybe I wanna use this with hypothesis. I mean, likely not because it's not really a good article, but it's a good example. All I need to do is go over to the tool that we here at Hypothesis have created. It's called docdrop.org backslash OCR, and it looks like this. Now I'm going to go ahead and select my file from my device. So the article that you, or the reading that you need to OCR or add an OCR layer to must live on your device for this to occur. Find my article here. I'm gonna go ahead and hit open. It's gonna upload. I'm going to now choose Run OCR. We're gonna give it a minute. And now I can download my newly OCR'd article. So I'm gonna go ahead and download it. And it should appear. I'm gonna test this to see if I'm able to select individual text. And as you can see, I am. Now my article has an OCR layer and I can add it to my LMS using Hypothesis. I can annotate this article with my students selecting individual text as I go. Of course, if you have any questions, please contact us over here at Hypothesis. We are always happy to help.